let me out alone Cause where you go is where I go I don't need nobody else I got you And you got me too Welcome back or welcome if you are new. I'm Tamara. Today we are slowing things down just a little bit and I'm going to share a little bit of my morning with you guys. I already took Winston to school as you've seen and now I'm back home. I've got myself ready and I'm going to work on a few things around the house. I didn't have a lot going on this morning. The house was actually pretty decent. I didn't have to do a ton of stuff. So I'm just working on a few things. I did have a busier afternoon, so I did have to cut the video short. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoy some spring homemaker motivation. Maybe this will motivate you to get some things done. Or this might be a reminder to slow down and just, you know, take a moment and enjoy the little things. Nonetheless, I hope you enjoy. Today's video is extra special though because it, it is in collaboration with my good friend Amanda over at Amanda Arujo. I will have her channel and her video linked down below. Please, please go make sure you give her some love. We recently just met from the Valentine box swap and we are now friends. And I love her channel. Her family is so sweet. She has the sweetest kiddos. They are adorable. She's also a boy mama. So it is just so much fun getting, you know, to meet new people. So it's great making a new friend this year. So I know you guys are going to love Amanda. So please make sure you go check out her channel. I will have everything linked in the description box. But let's go ahead and get our day started. I had been meaning to make me a batch of my sleep tea blend. I had just been getting each individual herb out, you know, doing it every night or whenever I wanted it. It really just depends on if I want something hot before bed or if I want like an ice drink, like with the tart cherry juice and the Olipop, it really just depends. But between these two and the magnesium spray, it has really helped me get pretty decent sleep. Absolutely love it. Y'all know I no longer take melatonin and I am pretty proud of that if I'm honest. <laughs> So for my blend, I like to do a skull cap, chamomile, lavender, passion flower, lemon balm, and holy basil. It does kind of change time to time. It really just depends. Um, but these are pretty much my go-tos for sleep. They are all absolutely amazing. Now, I always say this when it comes to herbal things is make sure you do your own research. You know, even consult with your doctor. But I'm going to go ahead and just get this. Um mixed up so i just do equal parts of each one and i started out with one tablespoon of each realized i had more room and i honestly could have done probably three tablespoons each in that jar um but what i do is you know i'll shake that up and that will just be my sleep tea blend and then whenever i go to make a cup of it you'll use a tablespoon of that mixture for about eight ounces of liquid
lost again going back around dreaming of a time when i get things right lost in the shadows of a million stars shouldn't they invite my near and far shouldn't they at all just tell me I came downstairs to check on my seeds and nothing is happening yet. I'm patiently waiting and hoping that I can get these, get these babies going. And I swear I come down here a hundred times. I go downstairs a hundred times a day now just to check on them. <laughs> I did order me some heat mats. I will have those linked. I got those off Amazon. I'm really hoping that that's going to help. So we'll see. Fingers crossed that I can get, get my seeds going this year, but Y'all already know the kitchen's a mess. Real world around here. Also need to catch up on laundry, so let's go ahead and get that done. Say you think about me because I'm starting to doubt we will find a way back to each other when you're on the side of the world I'm here and I'm waiting but I know I can't say that we've been ended for good reason still I'm hoping we'll be meeting soon everybody needs some time to figure themselves out but I want to close and I still Tell me we can work it out, forget about the past, not time. 
get whatever she put her mind to Late night hours up the hill Serving coffee to strangers Talking about revenue She kept dreaming of a world Big enough for everyone But she knew it must rain before it grows She kept dreaming of the day Butterflies survived the wheel Even though she could knock down and never show I have officially started spring cleaning. If you missed my first spring clean video, I will have it linked down below. But today's goal, since I had, you know, errands and stuff that I needed to do that afternoon, my main goal for spring cleaning wise was to deep clean the windows and luckily I was able to get them done. It was really nice having a slower morning but still being productive and getting things done plus I even stayed on my spring cleaning to-do list so I'm proud of that as well after I got done mopping that was pretty much it for me Max and I went for a walk as you can see he has to get his wiggles in every time especially if the Sun is out and it's warm he always has to wiggle wiggle in the grass while we were out, I ended up harvesting some stinging nettle. There is amazing properties with this, you guys. And it is literally growing probably outside right now in your front or backyard. So it is free to you. Go harvest some and dry it out. 
and make you some tea out of it. They have um, a website linked down below so y'all can see them as well. But I just harvested a little bit. I will definitely go out there and do more. Um, I just grabbed a little bit while I was out there and gave it a good wash when I came in. And here I'm just gonna kind of roll it up in this towel just to dry the water off. And then I'm going to uh, dry this in the dehydrator and then I can add it into my tea. I am so happy to get this. So stinging nettle, one way to identify uh, stinging nettle is it has a square um, stem. It has a square stem on it. There is different kinds, so you know make sure that you're getting the right one. Um, it has a square stem on it, and it's got the bigger leaves with those little purple flowers. So I'm so happy to finally harvest some of this and get it dried out. That way I can add it into my herb cabinet but y'all this is it for me until i need to leave i really hope y'all enjoyed today's video thanks so much for spending some time with me please please make sure you go over and check out amanda i'll have her channel and her video linked in the description box i hope y'all enjoyed it and i will see y'all in the next one bye guys